The border properties define the border around an element. They allow us to specify the style, width and color for all sides or for each side separately. There are also properties for setting all values at once. All of these properties can be applied to any element and they do not inherit. To make the border visible, we first have to set the border style to something other than none, which is the initial value. As we can see, there are several options for how it can be displayed. Border width sets the width of the border. We can set it as a unit of length or using one of the predefined values, thin, medium and thick. Then there is border color that sets the color of the border. Each of these three properties can have one to four values to change the individual sides of the border. The second value will apply to the left and right borders. The third value will apply to the bottom border and the fourth will apply to the left. Another way to set the individual borders is using the four sub-properties. These four exist for all three of the main properties by adding top, bottom, left or right to the property. The border property can set all sides and properties for the border in one declaration. They can be set in any order. The border property also has four sub-properties for setting all properties of the individual sides.